Greetings and welcome to another exciting episode of the Jetline Marvel. In this video, we'll look at some of the incredible characteristics that set the V-280 helicopter apart from the Black Hawk. The U.S. Army plans to replace its legendary Black Hawk helicopters with thousands more cutting-edge aircraft. The new V-280 Valor helicopters from America can tilt their propellers to allow them to fly at speeds akin to fixed-wing aircraft while taking off and landing vertically. For the future vertical lift program of the United States Army, Bell and Lockheed Martin are creating the Bell V-280 Valor, a tiltrotor aircraft. The Black Hawk helicopter will be replaced by this one. Since 1979, almost 4,000 helicopters have been constructed and are now being used in the United States. The S-70 is the latest modified variant of this helicopter. This helicopter serves a variety of purposes for U.S. defense, and it has also seen action in numerous conflicts. The Black Hawk will be replaced by the new V-280 in the upcoming years. The joint multi-role technology demonstrator phase was launched for the program in 2013, and the U.S. Army was chosen for it. The helicopter was developed in conjunction with Lockheed Martin, and it has consistently demonstrated scientifically sound programmatic and goal-oriented performance. The V-280 is built for a top speed of 300 knots, or 556 kilometers per hour a cruising speed of 280 knots, or roughly 520 kilometers per hour, a range of 2,100 nautical miles, and a combat range of 500 to 800 mi. Maximum takeoff weight is anticipated to be around 30,000 pounds or 14,000 kilograms. The engines are kept in position while the rotors and drive shafts tilt, which is a significant improvement over the older V-22 Osprey tiltrotor. In the case of an engine failure, both prop rotors can be driven by a single engine, thanks to a drive shaft that passes through the straight wing. Retractable landing gear, a triple redundant fly-by-wire control system, and a V-tail design will all be features of the V-280. Bell and Lockheed claim that an AV-280 version may launch rockets, missiles, and even miniature unmanned aerial vehicles front or aft without rotor interference, even in forward flight and cruise modes, with the rotors facing forward. It will be a modern helicopter that is equally recognizable as the Chinook. Each helicopter needed a crew of four to operate. The Bell can accommodate 14 soldiers, while the Black Hawk can accommodate 11 soldiers or 6 stretchers. Bell is 50.5 feet long, while the Black Hawk is 64 feet. The Bell weighs 8200 kilograms when empty, while the Black Hawk weighs 5675 kilograms. Black Hawk has a General Electric turboshaft engine, whereas Bell is powered by two Rolls-Royce turboshaft engines. Bell has a maximum speed of 320 miles per hour, 520 kilometers per hour, a combat range of 1,480 kilometers, and an operating range of up to 3,900 kilometers. Its service ceiling can reach 6,000 feet. Black Hawk's maximum cruise speed is 294 kilometers per hour, its maximum combat range is 590 kilometers, and its maximum ferry range is approximately 2,221 kilometers. Up to 19,000 feet of service ceiling are provided. Comment here with your opinions on V280. Please subscribe if you're a new viewer of our channel.